How's it going my video editors? I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to make a professional transition uh, screen wipe whoosh transition where you know you've seen those professional videos from those big time YouTube channels that have millions of views and millions of subscribers where uh, from when they're switching from one scene to another it does a whoosh effect the swoosh and it, it looks so cool I'm gonna show you guys how to do it uh, I've done it for LOL TV for a pranking channel that I have um, you guys gotta check it out it's awesome but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to do it. So here I have a video of my buddy just walking here. We are doing, a, this is actually a part, a clip from a prank video we were doing. He's just walking there, right? Um, we're gonna go ahead and cut it in the middle. Now if with Vegas Pro, you gotta select on the top of where you see the, the numbers on your timeline here, you gotta select on top. We're gonna select them smack down in the middle of the video here. We're gonna right click it split now we're gonna do a whoosh effect between these two uh, videos that we just split now you probably have another video that you that you're putting it, it works the same way now pretend this is your second video this is the first video and you're trans you're trying to transition from one to another that's just how it's gonna look right there two videos together now on the bottom right hand corner of Vegas Pro you can zoom in there's a zoom in button right here select that I'll we'll click on it to zoom in now we zoomed in. We got to zoom in in, in order to be able to do this. All right. So first, we got to make the transition go smoothly. So you you click on the right hand side on the right hand video here, the one on the right. You click and drag it to the left until you see negative six or seven. I don't know if you saw that right there, but on the on the top of the clips, it'll show you a little a little. Uh, dialogue there with some numbers and make sure it says seven and right here it says seven actually there we are there it says seven so make sure you click and drag it slowly to the left until you see seven so now we have a smooth transition now we get to add the swoosh effect click on the uh, transitions tab right here click on that and we're gonna go ahead and, and get linear wipe so it's you notice it's just gonna wipe to the right. Click on that and click and drag it to the middle where the 0 0.07 is, and there it is. Now we have a linear wipe. We're gonna play the video and you're gonna notice how it's gonna do that. Check it out, guys. It went a little bit fast, but it's there. My computer's a little slow right now. You guys can, let me slow it down a little bit. I think I have it too fast. Negative seven is a little too fast. I'm gonna set it for negative 17. Let's see how that, no, that's actually negative four. Let's set it for negative 13. Did you see, you guys saw that? There's a swoosh right there, guys. Swoosh. Now we got the swoosh. Now all we need is the actual sound effect. Now I have a sound effect here that I got from YouTube. I recommend you guys use a YouTube downloader to download the YouTube video of the swoosh effect. I'm going to go ahead and play it for you guys. Actually, I don't know what I did there. So let's go ahead and click and drag it down here up to the bottom of the video. And each one of these lines here is a swoosh. I'm going to go ahead and play it so you guys can hear it. You guys heard that? So we're going to click and drag. If you put the cursor on the right hand side of this clip here, this audio clip, you can drag it. And I'm going to make it I'm going to drag it right before it ends there, right right after it ends there, and I'm going to click on the left-hand side and drag it right before it starts. And now we're going to click and drag that to where we have our swoosh effect going on. And like I said, you can uh, go to YouTube and search for sound effects. Use the YouTube downloader. Let me show you guys how it looks like. This is where I get all my effects is from YouTube. Use this right here, the YouTube downloader. Once you have the video file, you go ahead and um, use this program here, any video converter, and you convert it to MP3 audio. Once you convert it to MP3 audio, then you can uh, put it on here. I will post a link on the description of the video for the YouTube downloader link and for the any video converter down uh, any convert any video converter program download link. Also, I'll put on there so you guys have all the tools to do this. So now we have the swoosh right there. Let's play it and let's see how it looks. Did you guys see that? 
So there's the swoosh effect. Now it's the same exact video that we just split. That's why it doesn't look uh, like it's changing to something else. But when you use a completely different scene coming in, it's gonna look awesome, guys. But I just wanted to use this clip just to show you guys how to do it. But when you guys use it on your clips, it's gonna look a lot better. But that's how you do it, guys. Now let's play it one more time and you're gonna see the swoosh effect. Let's make this bigger so you guys can see it. Check it out. Cool, it sounds, that sounds pretty cool. So that's how the professionals do it, guys, with Vegas Pro. You just uh, click and drag it to the left, like I said. And then you add the audio file right there. Thanks for watching, guys. I know it's a lot to take in. If you have any questions, go ahead and comment on the comment section of the video. I'll be happy to answer your questions. And don't, don't forget to subscribe, like the video. I'm going to be uploading a lot more Vegas Pro tutorials. Stay tuned for the upcoming videos.